Hello, and welcome to another WinQS tutorial. My name is Henry, and I will be your tutor for this video. Today I will be showing you how to transfer your projects over from an old computer to a new computer. In other words, I will be showing you how to use the global projects restore function. Firstly, you will need to do a global backup on your old computer. You can do this in two ways. Either log into WinQS, open one of your projects, and click on the global backup option from the backup tab, or open the WinQS admin app. The password is password in caps. Then open the backup locations tab and click on the global backup button. Notice the message that pops up once the global backup is complete. This tells you where your global backups have been saved. Take note of this file path. Users can however check the file path at any point by going to the backups tab in the WinQS admin app, or by opening preferences in WinQS itself. This message also gives you the option to copy. If you choose this option, you will be prompted to choose a location to copy the global backup to. Note, this does not change your backup file path. This is simply an option for users to quickly copy the global backup they have just done to another folder on their computer or to an external storage device. For this example, I have copied my global backup to my desktop. If you, however, click OK, the message will be cleared, and you will need to copy the global backup from the folder which was indicated in the global backup completion message. In this example, the backup location is the default backup folder, located in the WinQS data folder under My Documents. So, to copy the global backup to a new computer using this method, you simply need to copy the entire backup folder over to your new computer. For this example, I am going to use WeTransfer to send the backups to my new computer. The method you choose to do this is however entirely up to you. Notice how the contents of both the global backup folder just created and the standard backup folder are exactly the same. For that reason, I am only uploading the global backup folder I copied to my desktop. You also only need to choose one of these two methods. Once your global backup or backup folder has been copied to your new computer, you need to copy the backup files in that folder to the WinQS backup folder. The backup folder I am referring to is the folder which is set as the backup file location in WinQS on the new computer. Again, in this example my backup folder is the default one located under the WinQS data folder. If you are unsure of the backup file path you can do a quick check following the steps I mentioned earlier. Now that the projects have been copied into your backup folder, you can start the global projects restore. To do so, open the sample project in WinQS as this is by default the only existing project on new installations. Then open the file tab and click on the global projects restore option. Notice the number of projects WinQS detects. If this does not look right to you, then you need to make sure you have copied all your project files into the correct backup folder. Finally, click on the yes option and allow the system to load. And voila, as per the report, all your projects have restored successfully. To check this, simply close the report. And go to File, Open Project. All your projects should now reflect here. And that is how you use the Global Projects Restore function. Please note that if you just copied the global backup folder into the backup folder, in other words, if you did not copy the actual project files into the backup folder, WinQS will not detect these projects during the global restore.
Notice how in my demonstration WinQS only detects one project, instead of 14 projects. This is because I have deleted the individual project backups and simply copied the global backup folder into the WinQS backup folder. Please take note of this and be sure not to make this mistake. WinQS, developed and brought to you by Ace Solutions.